Hi guys, hope you're well. It's just a short video that I've recorded to go with the conditioning, the bodyweight conditioning circuit that you you will see as an option on the conditioning program that's now online. Okay, the conditioning circuit is it's just another option. If I don't have kit like a bike or or a rowing machine, or it's just not feasible for me to go out and put the runs in, this is another option. All I'm doing is moving my body through different patterns. I'm gonna get the heart rate elevated. I'm going between using upper body and lower body. How I do it, for how long, the duration, the intensity is all clear on the plan. So quite simply, this video is just to give you an idea of what it all looks like. The exercises should be familiar. But I'm gonna run through them. The example I've given on the plan is 30 seconds of work, 30 seconds of rest. So let's just assume I'm doing that and I'm just gonna run through this. So the first exercise you'll see is press up. So I quite simply push out my press up for 30 seconds. If I'm struggling with that, I can take them on my knees. No problem. Okay, or I can do them against an, uh, a raised uh, surface like the side of a sofa or a chair. Just go 30 seconds on, straight into 30 seconds rest. And then the next exercise you'll see is split squats. And again, I'm just working for 30 seconds. The way I would do this is I'll probably do five reps. I'll swap it round. I'll do another five. Good posture, good position, easy. You'll see on there, there's mountain climber one, two, and three. They're just variations of a mountain climber. But the first one is knee to same elbow. Knee to same elbow. Okay, from the front, I'm just here. Good press back position, trying to touch that elbow. Again, do my 30 seconds, rest for 30. Already my heart rate's up. This is a good way of getting that job done. Reverse lunge, alternating. Stepping back, trying to keep balance, trying to keep posture. Okay, that's important. Again, 30 seconds work, 30 seconds rest. High knees. Just on the spot, quite simply, just pumping arms and legs, getting my heart rate up, easy, okay? Next exercise, burpee, from here. Squat down, essentially, put my hands on the floor, jump back, back in and stand up, so I'm here. Jump out, stand up, jump out, stand up. That's too hard, I can just step out, step in, push myself up, okay? So there's always a way of progressing or regressing an exercise. Man climber, next one. Okay, knee to opposite elbow. Okay, so the same position. I'm just taking the knee across to the opposite elbow. Okay, prisoner squat. Stand up, hands behind the head, keep the head and chest up. I push up the squat. Okay, the whole point of having the hands behind the head Let's keep the head and chest up, okay? Third mountain climber, knees through the middle. Just pumping through the middle. Yeah, straight forward. And then the last one, you'll see it's called a sprawl. Very similar to a burpee, but the aim here is for me to get my hips on the floor. So I start standing, same deal, I go into a squat, jump out, hips to the floor, back into here and up. Hips to the floor, back in and up. There's my 10 exercises that are on the plan. The example I've given you, and now take a couple of minutes rest, and then I'll repeat that again. So the variables on that are, are endless. You know, 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off. If that's too much for me, if I'm getting halfway through thinking, wow, I can't do this anymore, I'll take longer rest, yeah? If I need a minute's rest, so be it. If I need two minutes rest, so be it. Make a note of these things. The whole point of this program is that we're tracking progress over these coming weeks, all right? So if I can't complete a circuit, for example, on day one, but in day 10, I can do it, there's progress right there, okay? So make sure the environment you're doing this in is safe, clear your floor space, set yourself up, and enjoy.